Full country people not be smarty they happen so you don't hear the matter <laughs> now our pastor pastor paul eneche the general overseer and the leader of uh, dunamis international the church day for abuja very big church uh, the abuja day not be wanting not be smart you know pastor paul eneche say god has answered us he said god all hear the prayer he said god all hear Nine people do they react to the vision when he share for church. Say we say Nigeria go must surely change. Say the judiciary they go do go get and put say things go work. Not be only pastor power meetings. What many Nigerians what they shout for all over the place. Say wait see, but now they tell you so don't cause another castle for another area. Um, <clears throat> you know our brother now. <laughs> And uh, as I read that, Kubo, it don't, it don't call Pastor Paul. Say, Pastor Paul, come, come, come. What do you mean, say, God, don't hear prayer? What do you mean by that? Mm -hmm. Eh, say, uh, judiciary, uh, go do this thing. He say, whether they like him, no, say, to no go be sworn in. Now, so he talk, oh. He say, and uh, whatever go happen, not be smart. If you never see that news without one shot, you do on your Apple Live Media, you go check on that video, you go see him for yourself, you get all the details. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up like us share subscribe let's get straight to the news god has answered us pastor paul Eneche says reacts to the visions shared in his church about nigeria during the early hours when pastor paul had a meeting the general overseer of the dynamics international gospel center pastor dr paul Eneche reacted to a vision a man shared in his church about nigeria the whistler identified as David Moses claimed that after their prayer last night, he had an encounter where he saw the flag of Nigeria coming out of the ground. He claimed he saw a bright light like the early morning rising sun shining on the flag of Nigeria and he saw the flag of Nigeria everywhere around the world. Moses David also claimed that he heard a voice saying, we, saying where is scripture have i where in the scripture have i failed if i have not failed in the scripture i will never fail in nigeria reacting to the striking vision dr paul and said god has finally answered our prayers nigeria shall be great again in conclusion he said many may you live to see that day come to pass in jesus name this was disclosed in a video that he sh that was shared on the church um you know youtube channel and pastor paul dr paul and said that you know uh, what has happened is that god himself has also um enabled or strengthened the judiciary to do the right thing and that the right thing will be done in terms of um you know um decisions that will be made uh, with regards to the elections that have just been concluded you know uh the presidential election man not speak english man go to the other side i mean i feel like which one you want english i'll be the other one okay man do the announcement and i'll come to english eh now so not be smart you know so he say we well, say god all hear the prayer he say the prayer whether they pray since say god all year he huh? say so many people not worry no no fret no need to the to the jump up to the no 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 you don't need to worry say because eh hmm. what you sit down they see so Two people sit down and no see ya. He says, so wait till they sit down, they see. Two people sit down and say, no see ya. He says, so no need to worry yourself, to the shot. He says, no, 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 no need for that. He says, because from where they stand, where they see everything, so. He says, things don't clear. He says, because another team, he says, the judiciary, God don't give their strength. So they go do the right thing. So they go judge the case where nobody go, nobody go conquer the court talk with it be lie. Nobody go talk true. That very matter when he talks so. Yee. Ah, it does set Kasala for turn. I feel the way they feel bad. If you say, we well, say, that they talk about it. They say, eh, we share judiciary, blah, 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 blah. Where? Now, there we did. We did look the old matter and we want the truth to become, you know, to become a, to become a watchword because we are tired of the same thing over and over again. Yes, this country has to move forward. It has to progress. It has to go forward. You know, because if you look at the whole scenario, all that has been happening, the clear indication that Nigeria cannot continue, you know, in the same space, you know, where we are, where we've been, we've been having people who do not really care about the nation one bit, 
come into leadership and do as they please you know just you know just uh you know meddle around important decision those areas are long overdue you know we are eradicating those places as we all begin to rise up to say enough is enough so we are rising up yes it's the dawn of a new day or those people don't blast pastor paul say hey, what do you mean hey, when i want too much when i do this when i do that so Many waters, they many matter they ground with your will of us, they look at and we they wait for the right thing to be done. At the end of the day, this country will become the country that we all, you know, really earnestly desire and we are hoping for and we are sincerely, you know, we want things to change. So here it is, and um, here is what is happening, and we sincerely truly want Nigeria to be a better place. So, in case you are not aware, in case you don't know it. You know, there are all kinds of, you know, matters and issues arising and Nigeria is becoming, you know, that nation, that place that people are beginning to really, really wonder, you know, where do we go from here? You know, it's bad enough that bad leadership has bastardized us, bastardized us left, right and center, you know, and we're just trying to really pick up from the pieces because um, we, we've seen again and again, you know, people who you know, have no, 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 no one, one of, of leadership, can't even, you know, look after themselves, are the ones meddling into affairs of, you know, national interests and what have you. So it is, it is what it is. And if change is going to come, every single one of us will have to, you know, arise and ensure that, you know, we do what is right and necessary to bring us into the right position. Yes. Uh -huh. So it is, uh, it is a matter of serious concern, okay? And uh, uh, everybody is rather, you know, rather wanting this change to come now. Everybody is looking out for it and saying, you know, it is time. It is real time that we, 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 we rise up, okay? And, and we all want this country to be what it needs to be. Anyway, my people, what do you think? The whole, the whole you know, the whole issues of everything going on right now, has shown to us, okay, that Nigeria needs, you know, the dawn, need a breath of fresh air. We, we need a breath of fresh air. We are tired of everything and anything that has held us down for far too long, okay? So it is, it is, it is, it is sincerely, you know, a position where we all need to rise. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Like us, share, subscribe. God bless. Have a fantastic day from us. It's bye for now. Have a good day. Bye-bye.